Good freaking morning. No, I'm joking. I could have stopped doing that rich piano intro. Uh, or just good morning. Today is gonna be a back day. What am I gonna do for back? Same as always, pull downs. Uh, what else? Rows and pullovers. Uh, so I'm pretty sure pull downs and such. Or for this is how they'll call this bro science explains it, or I don't, I don't know. I don't know if it's like research proclaiming this, but pull downs are supposed to help with the thickness of your back or the thickness, the wideness of your back. Then, regular, what's it called? Oh, yeah, rows. So it's to help with the thickness. Like I said, pull downs, rows, and to be honest, I know I did T bar rows last time, but I'm still a fan of the cable, the seated cable rows. We don't have like a a machine that is specially made for like rows, but come on now, I mean this this cable could do a lot. I'll, I'll be honest, I need to get one, but I don't think I have space over here and my grandma wouldn't let me really even make space for a cable. But let's see what else there's to talk about. Mm, I'll move over here to my room. Let's see. Yeah, so I guess there really isn't much to talk about. I gotta get my socks on. I gotta get Shoes, I get clothes in my backpack. Oh, I gotta get a whole bunch of stuff done. I don't know, a whole bunch of stuff, let's just be honest. I'll be out by like in 10 minutes. But I do have to wrap up this intro because what's it called? I'm a little short on time. So, as you can tell, if, I, if I'm recording the intro in the bathroom, then that just means I'm a little short on time. So, I'm gonna let you guys uh, just cut to the Probably first warm up sets of lap pull downs. See you then. So, no talking in today's video because we got some Bob Marley playing in there. But you will see after after this clip, I'm gonna be doing pull downs. And I know that pull ups are really good for back development, so I'll probably throw in that. But yeah, other than that, there's nothing much to talk about. Uh, I'll throw in um, some, some what's it called? Oh my goodness, it looks so stupid. Let me fix this. Make sure my hair doesn't mess up underneath. All right. So yeah, I will throw in some, what the frick was I gonna say? Uh, oh yeah, yeah, I will throw in some voiceovers for everything because I can't talk. So yeah, let's go to the first set of pull downs. All right, so like I just explained, I believe in the last clip, music was playing. We were bumping Bob Marley. So I know I, you see me have my headphones on. Whoa, what did that say? <laughs> so. Lap pull downs. You, as you see, I do have the straps with me. Why? Takes your forearms and biceps out of the equation and just lets you focus on really feeling that lat fire. Pretty sure I did. Oh, I'm not sure how much that's the thing. I think like four or five. So right here, I'm pretty sure I just lowered the weight because I think the. 
I think I only got seven for that last clip. But this, I just really... Just, I mean... What, what can I say? I was just repping some stuff out. So yeah, see, every set I go to failure, I don't leave any juice in the lemon, if you want to use that analogy. So this is the third set. Yeah, again, same thing, different camera angles. I do apologize that I couldn't talk between, not, not, not between, I guess you could say between sets, because why would I be talking to you while I'm doing a set? But the main thing you want to focus on when you're doing any, I say back, any, any movement that requires, say you pull towards your body, especially like using your arms, you want to imagine that there's a string attached to your elbow and it's just pulling down. For example, that that's going to come more into play when we start the rows because you'll, you'll just see, you'll see. I'm pretty sure we did pull-ups though. Yeah, yeah. so pull-ups. I guess same thing, but I mean, pull-ups pretty, I say it just sets you up for success of how it's one, you're coming from the ground up to the bar that you're pulling on. So you kind of have no choice but to, you know, I guess pull from your elbows. I would say, it's kind of different when you're doing pull-ups because, again, like I said, it's already set up for you. But yeah, I'm pretty sure the first set, I didn't really get that much pull-ups. Then I got the resistance band. Then I just repped out more pull-ups. And I'm pretty sure here I'm about to talk, so bye. All right, so I think I can talk right here. So one more set of these pull-ups. Hopefully this phone doesn't fall, but one more set, and then I have the band. Oh, uh, what's it called? And then we'll go to Rose. All right, so these are the cable rows. I I love these. Like usually, some lat pull downs will have this integrated into the actual machine, but obviously, as you can see, the one on the left doesn't. So as I explained here, the straps just help with not getting your forearm or biceps involved. But I'm pretty sure you can see that. I am imagining that there's a string attached to the back of my elbow and I'm just pulling back and controlling the way the you guys know I, I should I'll explain the eccentric and co-centric uh, during the biceps but controlling the eccentric which is when you're going back I guess down actually so co-centric right here eccentric co-centric eccentric so yeah these rows, I guess, more target the, I guess, it's thickness of the back. And then lot pull-downs and pull-ups are more for the width. Her width, width. Uh, <laughs> Alright. <laughs> but yeah, this is a good set. I'm pretty sure I got, I got three? Or it might have been two and then a drop set. Let's see here. I'm pretty sure we did drop sets. So when I failed, obviously lower the weight. I didn't put this. I was gonna put the straps back on, but I kind of didn't want to waste time. So, yeah, drop set. Still controlling the weight. Again, co-centric, eccentric. Co-centric, eccentric. Co-centric. Co right, I'll stop. But yeah, that was a good couple of sets. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna drop it again right here. Oh, and before I, I get to the bump check, I am getting a. Uh, a leg extension machine. So <laughs> those those uh leg days are gonna be eventful to say the least. <laughs> I'm so happy. Can't wait for that to come in. Alright, so I'm pretty sure the pump check is coming soon after these after right here, right here. Alright, so bye. <laughs> 
All right, so hopefully my phone doesn't fall. But we are feeling freaking pumped. I wonder if I should take out the shirt. Let me do some pump checks with the shirt on first. Yeah, my phone's still up. Let me turn this down just a tad bit. There you go. What else is it for back? My back is freaking pumped, that's all I gotta say. Oh, take out the shirt. Hit the tank, I should say. How do we stop I think there is still some abs, but I don't know, it's not even fucked. It's freaking chest. Is this? <sighs> Let's see. <sighs> oh my goodness. Rude last bird. Oh my goodness. So let's see how that looks like. And then, I don't know, let's see if I shoot another. Oh, let's cut to the in outro, or bicep. You say like, I'm, I'm dressing like a, oh my goodness, I don't remember my team cut out the way. Like a frat boy. Does, does this look like a frat boy? Like, do I really have bands, band socks, these shorts that, or stain and just a freaking whatever this is called the uh, polo come on now all right but so this workout is going to be more towards the education side of i guess going towards biceps so for biceps it's, it's re oh my goodness fall back i think i'm in frame i'm not sure if i am <clears throat> for bicep it's really simple because Pretty much, I mean, you see in the, most of my bicep workouts, it's just curls. Yeah, curls, curls. It, it's mostly all curls. If anything, it is all curls. There's really no need to overcomplicate such a simple muscle. Because all your bicep does is pull up, down. So, again, you're going to see me start on regular dumbbell curls. I guess some people would like, do hammer curls, which are still curls. So, yeah, stuff like yeah. hammer curls, regular, I guess, what are they called? I don't know, just curls. <laughs> oh, what else? Yeah, that's all you could pretty much do with dumbbells. The, I do see some fancy, like this, and they go like that, down. Or that, and they go like this down, or like that, this, and they turn around and they go like backwards. I feel like there's is that stuff like that's really not necessary, especially when it's not really gonna make that much of a difference. If you're say you're doing hammer curls, I know some people like it targets some forearms. Just hit forearms separately if you want bigger forearms. Why do something? It's like saying I'm gonna do biceps, but I'm gonna do. I'm gonna hit back because there's just a teeny bit of bicep activation. So, oh, I warmed up with those 20s right there. I'm probably gonna slap on, let's see how 40s move. I'm not gonna go straight to 40s, but I'll do a warm up with 30s and then go to the 40s. So yeah, let's cut to that. How much time do I work out? Or how do I work out every day? Uh, pretty much. Yes, I know that's, I guess studies show that you shouldn't work out every day, but I feel as if, if you're making progress, like, 
weight wise like say you're going heavier each time you're working out and you notice more obviously mass going on your frame i say that you're fine working out every day and take that with a grain of salt because there's a whole bunch of different ways to train that don't involve you working out every day for example like hit training which is going to be you work out like three to four times a week but you go really hard it's high intensity training that's what hit means um i pretty much do high intensity training every day i'd say so because i do each set of failure most of my sets i should say this t obviously 10 reps like i'll just stop at 10 but i feel like i go to failure either way because i if i could do more than 10 then obviously i went too light so i'll just go to failure from then but I heard that it's not actually good to train every day. Like you don't give your body enough recovery. But I, I'm pretty sure I do take rest time to time. It's just, I don't know. Um, even if I do rest, I still do cardio. So do you really call that a rest day? Yes. Yeah. So when you're going to like, when you're trying to target biceps, especially like the best way to hit them, control the way down. So the way down, when I say, eccentric that means from here coming down the co-centric is going up so that so especially for don't do this for every set um this is really targeted towards biceps uh i guess you could say towards other stuff but i don't want to make you guys injure something but especially when on curls what you want to do is curl up and then just control the way down. So you could even put some swing into it if you can't. So say you're just keeping your form really strict. And then say you can't do any more. So you're like, you could still do like a little swing. Just control the way back down. So yeah, let's move on to 40s. So I got that, I guess, uh, would you even call this a pump cover? Like, <laughs> They're pretty tight around the look at sleeves. Oh my goodness, all right. I don't know how much I got there. I'm pretty sure I did not get 10, but we'll drop on to 30s and we'll go from there. All right, so another set. How much sets am I gonna do? Probably about like five. So this is my second. So look, now you can swing. Ah. 
Oh, my goodness. Ooh. So, yeah, we're getting a pretty good pump from that. So let's do, I'll stay on the 30s. I just do three more sets. one more set. I don't know if you guys even see me. That was one more set. I think that was our third. So let's do two more. Oh my goodness. Come on, I got more. Oh my goodness, what the heck? Ah, come on, come on. I like pinched a nerve, or not a nerve, but like, I don't know. Just felt weird on my finger. But let's do, I think, one more set, then we'll be done. Oh my goodness. Ooh. Was that our fourth set or fifth set? If it's fourth set, then one more. If it's a fifth, then we'll cut to spider curls. All right, so like always, it's gonna be a mess right here, but let's see. There you go. Ah. Yeah, it is kind of a mess right here, but next set is gonna be the typical spider curls. I love this. I love these spider curls. So, the basic premise of this, or when I do it this time, obviously I'm gonna, I'm gonna skip those eight through ones and just wrap them straight through. So I'm gonna do however much I could do and then just try to hold it as long as possible, just right here. And yeah, I try not to be too loud because I might, I'm not gonna yell, but oh my goodness, I just know this is gonna burn. It's gonna be like four sets of this. Closer, to be honest.
Ah, come on. Ah, come on. Ah, come on. Oh my gosh. Ooh, that did get us pumped, I'll tell you that. Oh. So, four more sets of that. Matter That's of fact, one set. you know what I'm gonna do? <laughs> I'm already, I'm happy just thinking of this. I'm like, this got me, my energy boosted. So, eight, I'm gonna try to attempt eight through ones. This is kind of too heavy for eight through ones, but eight through ones, and then when I can't get it, I'll try to just, I'll either swing it up or just get up and then just hold it here and hold it as long as possible and hopefully my biceps just tear off the freaking bone. Yeah, all right, <laughs> let's get going. Oh my goodness, he's freaking burning. Come on. Ah, come on. Whew. This got me freaking pumped. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Three more sets of that. Look at these freaking. They're freaking pumped, man. Come on, come on, come on. <clears throat> oh. oh my goodness. Yo, I slobbered. Mm. Oh. All right, so. <laughs> Two more sets of that. Could have sworn the last set, I was about to tear something. <laughs> Hey, oh well. <laughs> It'll be funny if I do tear something, then I'll have it on video. But hopefully not. Optimally not. I'm just gonna hold it. Oh my god. Ooh. Again, I don't want to tear my freaking bicep. No. Uh, so, I wonder if, I think, 
I did say one more set. I think that'll be enough. Four sets is fine. I'm already fully freaking pumped. Okay, look at these. Look at those. All right, so hopefully so that's 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 fine. Time. My freaking voice is dead. I was yelling a lot today. Not right there, but like bef even before right now. I was yelling a lot. So. Look at those, man. Because there's a notable difference on the biceps. That's without, that's just with the polo on. Oh yeah. All right, so. Let's throw this stuff off. Let me take off everything though. Should I put the hat back on or just leave it like that? I look, like, look goofy like that, but let's try. So, let's check this out. Oh my goodness. Let's check this out, hold up. Let's do this side and then we'll do the other side. That would look freaky. Oh, okay, I know exactly what to do. Ah, so much flies on me. Let me put this hat back on. Ah. Oh my goodness, look at that. Look at freaking that. Let's do a rear double bicep. Let's see if I can get this to align too. It should be fine. Because usually when I do a, a rear double bicep, this one would be higher. So I'm going to see if I can just level it. <sighs> oh my goodness, I almost passed out right there. Whoa. All right, but yeah, look at those. Um, what else? Is uh, I guess what features the, the biceps? Look at those, man. What what else does? Oh, you know I said I was gonna do same thing, but from this side. Ah! <sighs> I mean, I pretty much just do everything for biceps. What else? Oh, I know exactly what to do. I guess this was this would be good. Oh, ooh, this dumb fly, man. Oh, that's good. Let's try this again. Oh, hopefully, that's fine. You know what I almost forgot to do? Freaking outro. Uh, after I was posing, I was just not irritated, but there was just so much flies on me. And I didn't, I was kind of doing some editing, sitting down. And I for, all forgot all about the freaking outro. Over there's fine. But back and biceps today was. I gotta say amazing. I always love a back day when you have access to cables slash pulleys. Yeah, it's always a a good back day. So, and then biceps, typical, typical freaking bicep pump. Oh my goodness, look at my freaking hair. Yeah. All right, well, oh well. Yeah, so I don't want to make this video too long. So I'm actually going to let you guys go very, very early. I hope you learned a thing or two from this video. And if you did, like, you might as well just freaking subscribe. If you even made it here, come on now. If you if you made it this far in the freaking video, you obviously like what you're seeing. Pause. All right, but whatever. Tomorrow will be... So I got to go to work. So I don't know if I'm going to... Make that a cardio day or a rest day. I did say they couldn't really take that much rests. I might be in due for one. But if I do live tomorrow, it'll be, oh my goodness, it'll be freaking legs. 
No, 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 no. So, I think what's going to happen is, most likely, I'm not going to say anything because uh, I don't want to promise. Like, it's going to be a cardio day, then I hit legs. So, yeah. What it is going to be for sure is... I should know. I said I ain't gonna promise anything. What the heck am I talking about? So let you guys get going. Hope you had a good day. Your day's gonna start. Hope you're gonna have a great one. I'm gonna probably eat. I'm I'm on cardio right now. But after this is done, eat. I don't know when I'm gonna shower. Probably before I go to sleep. Oh no. Yeah, pretty much eat cardio. Eat cardio. Eat 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 eat. I've been lacking on my vitamins, to be honest. Uh, usually I take multivitamin and fish oil. But I've been lacking. So hopefully I don't forget those. I gotta get those down as routine because I'm starting to take my creatine again. So yeah, so other than that, today is day 26, it might be 27, I don't know. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for tomorrow. I'll let you guys go. Bye.